Well, I'd say it's a great feeling to be back. Been a long 10 months kind of watching. You know, it's kind of hard, different place mentally. It's just a lot going on. You're trying to work to be back. i say it's a good feeling to be back. Go out every day, practice with an attitude, aggressive, just excited. Yeah, we 100%. We full go, but it's always work to be done. You personally feel 100%? Yes, sir. Tell me about your teammates, your room there. Really a lot of top-end talent, I think. You've got a lot of different guys that do different things. I'd say it's a lot of talent in the receiver room. I mean, I kind of feel like the things I do on the field could be done everywhere around. Like, I feel like people on the other side can hold their standard, their part, and I trust them on their side to do what needs to be done. It's, it's just getting better, proving people, you know, you, you, you had an injury last year. How, how excited are you to suit up to play the Florida State in the opener there? getting over that injury and kind of feeling that, getting that hit again there. How, how good is that going to feel? Uh, I mean, it's going to be a good feeling kind of picking up where I left off or just be better this time. Since Coach Kelly took over in December, how would you describe what has transpired here? How has he transformed the roster, the attitude, the everything with this team going into the season? I feel like since he got here, uh, things been great. It kind of progressed throughout time, and I feel like we're in a good environment under a great head coach. Hey, Sean, Uh, I kind of talked with Tyron Matthew a little bit. I'd say that's the one that kind of did reach out to me. We talked a little bit. Uh, he had visited, I'd say, a month or two ago. Kind of talked to the whole team. And I kind of just walked around the indoor, talked a little bit about everything that's going on. What did it mean to get selected as number seven? I mean, it felt great. You know, not too many people get to wear it. So knowing that I'm one of those people that had the honor of wearing it, it's just a blessing. Uh, I'd say my focus on football really been the same kind of NIL is just off the field stuff, but even though you're doing what you're doing, is football is number one. Jamar Chase won the bulletin call. Is that something on your radar? Uh, something you think about? Goal? Uh, I mean, I feel like the bulletin call is one of my goals, but I feel like if I didn't have my injury last season, I was on pace to win it. The room itself, you know, kind of who they put into the league. Obviously, there's OBJ and Jarvis kind of before and now. Uh, I mean, I feel like the guys that they did put in the lead, it's kind of they put LSU on the map is what I'm saying. So I feel like knowing that everybody is watching our group specifically, we just got to execute.